with it. Yamilka Daval of Cuba taking on Helen Lewis, two-time world medalist, world silver in 2012, world bronze last year, who comes in fresh off her sixth U.S. Open championship. She's won five in a row, getting that latest title in Las Vegas, and one of the big hopes for the American women. Assuming she wins her spot on the world team later this year and for the Olympics next year in Rio. 23-year-old from Rockville, Maryland, wrestling out of the New York Athletic Club. Marulis, in that early flurry, almost had control, but couldn't link up and latch on to Del Val. And Helen's just a, a very kind of a methodical wrestler, you know, breaks things down, doesn't, you know, really try to get in a flurry and just score a lot of points and just waste a lot of energy. She's very technical. She really works on a position. I've seen her just sit there and work for hours on the same position, trying to master it all the way around. And so if she ever gets in that situation again, she knows exactly where she stands. And, you know, smart wrestling, as you can see, you know, Helen doesn't really push unless everything is in place. You don't want to get lean because you get headlocked and ultimately you know, that's the position that uh, you know she looks like uh, you know she wants to stay is keep everything low and move forward you know, control your position we mentioned that litany of accomplishments for Marulis still just 23 years of age she's met her Cuban opponent a couple of times at the Cerro Pilato International Tournament the last two years she tech called her each time 10 zip, but right now it's a more even battle here, approaching the halfway point of this opening period. And Marulis wants to continue to just to pressure forward, you know, circle, circle, and you, you change a lot with your lead legs, potentially arm throw. Referee's gonna give it a two point takedown for the arm throw attempt. No points, now looking for a trapped arm gut wrench. So two for the takedown when Marulis got control. And now no advantage there, so they'll break them, get them back to the center and back to the action here. 117 on the moving clock in the first. Marulis with good pressure, you know, just kind of just methodically moving forward. And, and you have different styles of wrestlers. You have wrestlers that get real physical and real technical. And then you have wrestlers that just want to control the position. Control the position, put yourself in a good position all the time. And now Marulis giving up the underhook position. You gotta watch that for a wrestler. They can get that underhook, they can go for a headlock, they can go for a body lock. A lot of things can be done. Marulis looking to close out another takedown. The Val Gamely trying to hang on in defensive posture. No control and takedown awarded yet. And just very smart wrestling from Marulis not to, to push things because ultimately you can get potentially crotch lifted over for exposure for a two point turn and, and just be very smart about it. Very good, you know, scramble wrestling, not too aggressive, not too physically, you know. Basically, I guess you could almost say passive, but just very, just applying the pressure as she needs to, to secure the points and to be ahead for nothing. 15 seconds now. Under 15 left to go here in the opening period. Marulis looking to add to her impressive resume in competing here in Times Square. Fourth year in a row, Marulis has competed in a New York City event. She won the last two years by pins. Right now, she's got a couple of takedowns to her credit. And Marula starts off potential arm throw position. If you you make the attempt, you you take a big risk. But it's you know risk comes sometimes rewards or the spoil. And then ultimately to get taken down, Marula with the takedown and then back to the feet, and then to finish it off with a great takedown at the very end, and ultimately to get ahead for nothing. That's a big advantage, but, you know, Marulis, I know in her mind, she always just wants to kind of take territory. She wants to gain control. She wants to kind of take the will of your opponent, and that's the one thing about being so, you know, young and so smart is you just are very patient. You develop that over time and over time on the mat. Del Val, Pan American champion a half dozen years ago, age 27. And continuing to try to increase her level of status. And Marulis ranked at 55 kilograms, second in the world in this weight class. 
And Marulis has her actually her head in the down position. You know, even though she's kind of continuing to attack, the referees want to see Marulis open it up. But that's where Delval, it, she does so many little small things. She does them halfway, but you can't score unless you do it all the way. There's been a few times of, of an inside trip or a, a potential headlock position and just hasn't been able to compete. And again, Marulis comes back. Helen, just great, you know, patience and being smart about it. Got the two-point takedown, now looking for some more technique, and then, you know, ultimately trying to find a way to score some extra points and, you know, get that six-point lead ultimately to aid or, you know, to finish the match with a 10-point victory. Again, trying to continue the chain and maximize the point production. Turn one move into multiple moves and continue the score. Six-nothing here in Marulis. And again, Team USA trying to come up with another victory against Team Cuba. Slow, very kind of patient. Marulis could have, you know, gone right after the attack, tried to get the takedown and, and, and get the victory, but she realizes, I'm in this to win this match, one takedown at a time, not to try to force anything. And that's just very good, very solid, very patient. Marulis again, able to get in on the single leg. Another takedown, try to finish this off maybe with a turn here and close the deal with a technical fall. And that's the advantage of having that that eight point or the six point you know lead at that point. The ball had to do something to try to you know get a, a, a takedown or something. So she forward pressured and Marulis just set back, set back, was very patient. And as soon as she stepped in, circled around for the takedown to you know get the eight point uh, lead so far. That's that's insurmountable at this point. And ultimately, that's the match. Another takedown for Marulis. And for the third consecutive time against this Cuban opponent, Marulis ends it before the end of regulation. Her third straight 10-zip tech fall over Yamilka Deval.